Hello, hello, hello! And we are back with some more judgment. So, uh, last time we did the drone races, right? So, I finished them. I mean, uh, the collecting parts. Took a long time, but we got it. At the same time, I also uh, progressed in our um, Koi Koi. So we are like halfway done with that, which is really cool. Uh, I finished the arcade. This took a very long time. Like this final shot out, especially this one. Like win as all characters. You literally had to play one round with every single character in the game. And then I uh, finished the uh, Fighting Wipers and Sonic. It's just old games, you know. Not too important. And I did a lot of batting center. But I didn't want to fully finish it, so we have something to do now, right? So let's let's go. We need to f uh, basically finish the home run competition, which means playing every single stage at the same time in a row, right? So we can do that now. Um, yeah, I hope I do well. So I was doing a mistake last time. I was using the expert bat, but it, which actually makes the game harder, but not easier. What I'm was supposed to do is use the serenity bat, and I will see what's actually gonna happen. Here we go. All right, let's go. All right. <laughs> and we need uh, nice. pretty much eight home runs home runs in each of the sets <laughs> so we don't fail <laughs> okay nice <laughs> or nice It's so easy to hit a home run like this. Okay. One. Nice. Six. Next set. So six. One. Nice. Eight. Yeah. Seven. Next one's gonna be four. Okay, this wasn't a home run, I gotta focus now. Okay, six. Nice. Two. Yeah. Seven four two. Yep. Can do one more mistake here, but that's okay. Nice. Next set. Nice. Level three. <laughs> Six. Yeah. <laughs> Seven. Yep. One. <laughs> yeah. Five. Eight, eight, nine. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Yep. Nice. OK. 
Okay, next set. Nice. So seven. Huh. Yep. Five. So let's not fail this. Okay, one more. Yep. Nice. Next set. Nice. Three. Halfway done almost. Huh. Or yep. seven. Yeah. Huh. One. Fill this one. One. Huh. One. Nice. Five. Huh. Yeah. Four. Huh. Nice. Eight. One five nine. Okay. Either yeah. gotta hit the five or the nine. So let's go. Nice. Next set. Four. Nice. Three. Huh. 
seven a six. Starting with five. Huh. Yep. Two. Huh. Nice. Three. Huh. Oh, that was fast. Yeah. Okay. Now twice two now. So. Huh. Two. One more. Nice. Huh. Yep. Nine. Huh. Yeah. Five. Huh. Seven. Yep. Last three sets, nice. let's go. So four. Huh. Yeah. Five. Huh. Nice. Seven. Huh. Yep. Nine. Now we go back to five. Nice. Huh. Eight. Huh. Yeah. One, four, eight, four. So one. Eight four is not gonna happen. Yeah. So we're switching sets. Next set. Seven. Huh. Nice. Two. Huh. Yeah. Four four one six now. Very fast. Yeah. Three. Six. Seven. Six. Nice. Eight. 
three. Seven. Nice. And we are done. Okay. Oh, I'm done. Uh, let's just fail all of this for now. But we got it. That's nice. She could just skip this, but that's fine. Last one. And we're done. Clear. Rank S. We get our 13,000 points, minus the multiplier, we're at 7k. That means we might as well buy something from here, right? So what do we get? Kinda wanted the belt, you know? Expose duration by 30% will be sometimes useful, or something. And perhaps, I guess that's all we can get. Okay. Oh yeah. Let's not forget to save, right? Wouldn't want to lose this progress. Okay. Well, let me open the uh, town go app. So, shop missions. Everything on this tier list is uh, done except for uh, Koi Koi. Here we need 4.5k still. Uh, and the Mayong. I'll be only playing my own with the uh, with the uh, Ronald Sumo instant clear um, tiers, but you can only get them f by dropping stuff or thirty thousand SP per one. You know, so it's kind of like very expensive if you think about it. It's like six hundred thousand uh, SP just to clear these two, the other two, and here's I still need ninety k SP. Or I can drop them on the street by fighting Yakuza, which is what I'm waiting for. Uh, and Paradise VR, which we might play at some point. But I wanted to do something else today, right? And what better thing to do than to go back to Yokohama 99 in the commercial district. And let's look at our next mission on the on the board, you know? Because we need SP right now, and this is probably like the best way to get SP. So yeah, what do we have? My first errand gives 10,000 SP. Okay. My son wants to go to his first errand in his own, but I'm so worried what might happen to him. I'd follow him if I could, but he made it absolutely clear that I'm not allowed. If I do it anyway, and he catches me, he might resent me for it. That's why I would like you, the professional tailor, to watch over him in my place. We can discuss the details over a wet kitchen. If you are interested, my apologies if you are busy, but I do appreciate you considering this job. And it's gonna pay me 100,000 yen. Except. Alright, so we need to go to wet kitchen. I think it was here, right? I remember. Am I correct? Or is it somewhere completely different? No, this is wet kitchen. Okay, my bad. Well, let's travel back there anyways. And let's check. Uh, okay, wet kitchen has 
food. Let's see what type of food it has. If it has the four times, uh, four times gift, then we can try. Uh, I can try showing you how to get the uh, nine tile, nine tailgates items. So, does it have four? No, it has only three. You need four of these to even be able to grab it. So cannot do anything here. But let's find our client. It's probably upstairs. From the looks of it. Okay, I guess this is him. Let me grab this. Dirty iron. Hello. I'm Yagami, here on behalf of Yokohama 99. Ah, so you're a detective. Nice to meet you. I'm Manaka, the one who reached out to you. Pleasure's all mine. Now, if I remember right, you want someone to watch over your son while he's out on the town? Yes, that's correct. Our son, Tora, turned 5 just the other day. Ah, congratulations. Thank you. After a long debate with our son, we finally came to the agreement. When he turned 5, he can go on our own like a big boy. Looks like our stalling tactics finally blown up in our faces. Sending him out already, huh? They sure did grow up fast. This is a big milestone for a little guy. It sure is. So, my wife and I originally planned to watch from behind as he walked down the block on an errand, but our son's taken the terms of our agreement much more seriously. Mm -hmm. Meaning? He says, if we follow him, he's not really out on his own, so if we follow him, he's going to get himself emancipated. Mm -hmm. Wow, your son has quite a vocabulary. Where did he pick this stuff up, huh? Regardless, it's not an issue we want to press him with, It feels if he feels so strongly. But, I'm sure you're aware of all the adults walking around here, let alone the traffic. I'm just too worried to let him go on, on his own. We just moved to the city and we don't have any acquaintances here, so we figured we should ask a tailing professional. Please, sir, tell my son. I don't care what it costs. I just can't let him go unsupervised like that. My heart couldn't take it. I see. Oh, I wholly understand where you're coming from. I'll take the case, and I have enough experience with tailing that you won't have to worry about an emancipation. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Here's a picture of Thor. Oh. Looks like one smart little guy. Eh <laughs> thank you. I didn't know that half of it. Thor is so quick on the uptake, it's scary. You're going to have to be real careful out there to avoid his suspicion. I see. Good to know. But please, don't worry. I promise he's in good hands. We'll have eyes on him the entire time he's out on his own. And he won't even know it. Oh, well, isn't that good to hear? Thor is ready to head out now, down Isazaki Road. His job's to buy some bread at Pocket Cafe and then go right back home. In other words... So he needs a tail from Izaki Road to Pocket Cafe and back. Yes, when you're ready, I'll call my wife and she'll let Toru out of the house. Yagami-san, should I call my wife uh, so my son can get ready for his errand? Uh, I'm ready. Yep. Yeah, I'm good to go. Got it. I'll make the call now. Yes, it's me. Commence the operation. Indeed, everything moving along exactly as conceived. Now, we'll play the waiting game. I think I figured out where the kid got his vocabulary. Alright, Yagami-san. I should return home. I want to see Toro before he leaves so he knows I'm not tailing him. Best of luck in your endeavor. Yep. Right, leave it to me. I'll keep you updated. Better get ready to tell this kid. <laughs> Pretty interesting you've got a uh, gig you've got there, Tak. <gasps> yeah, Kaido-san, where, where are you this whole time? Well, die yourself. I only stopped in for a bite. <sighs> oh, what a coincidence. Yo. I think I'll join you in this case, if you don't mind. Huh? Really, Kaido-san? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good with kids, and I mean, you're all doing this tailing the little guy, right? Besides, watching kids do grown-up shit, blood errands, it's pretty amusing. I love when they do that kind of stuff on TV. Oh yeah, you and Hish Higashi t used to watch that one show back at Matsugana family office all the time. Come on, let's bounce. Karu-chan's gonna be leaving soon. Yeah, it's Torokun.
Man, I'm starting to get nervous. Nah. Yeah? Why is that? <laughs> Come on, and this is a big first step for the kid. All sorts of stuff could go wrong. He might get lost, he might trip and eat it. You see a kid come through it the other day of something, uh, of something like that with a big grin. It's pretty great, you know? I'd better make sure I do a good job as guardian angel here. I guess so. Well, it's pretty much a straight beeline to the cafe from his place. I'm sure he'll be fine. Huh. Oh, there he is now. Big man hitting the streets. Let's get to work. Be careful here. Where is he? Oh, there. Just gotta wait here, pretty much. Okay. Hmm. Ah. Whoa. Crap. Hmm. Ooh, that was close. I know his dad warned us, but this kid's got eyes like a hawk. Yeah. Yeah, but it looks like we aren't busted just yet. Let's keep after him. Yeah. Right, and what are we gonna do about this? Hmm. We are, uh, well, hell. My damn noggin's stuck. How about you, Dak? Yeah. Yeah, um, I'm stuck too. And I've got the short one for kids. This is not good. Wait, these are for kids? No wonder I'm stuck. No, oh, Kairo-san. Yours is for adult. This one's, uh, this is one of those things for a parent and a child to get pictures with together. Huh? Wait, the hell are you saying about my size of, size of my head, Doc? Come on, we don't have time to do a bit. We're gonna lose Torukun if we don't pick it up. Oh, right, then what do we do about this? <sighs> Not much we can do. We'll have to literally pick it up and tell the kid. I guess we'll just have to pl try playing cool if he busts us. You gotta be kidding. Oh no, y you serious? Don't jet ahead, Kaito-san. The idea is to not get spotted. No. We talk. If you don't pick up the pace, we're gonna lose him. And you're too fast, Kaito-san. Why can't you just slow down a bit? Talk. If you don't pick up the pace, we're... Hmm. Ah! Crap. Are we busted? Nice muscles! Oh, right. Gotta focus here. <sighs> that was close. But what did he mean by muscles? Nah. Beats me. Who knows what kind of shit's the on the other side of this thing. Hope it's nothing too weird. Now let's go, before we lose him. Come on, Kaito-san, match my pace. You're gonna break my talk. You're, You're gonna break my neck. Pace, we're gonna lose him. And you're too fast, Kaito-san. Why can't you just slow down? Hmm. Ah. Crap. Are we busted? Hmm. Hmm. Nice muscles. All right. Gotta focus here. Wait, why is he moving so fast? <sighs> that was close. But what do you mean by muscles? Yeah. It is the same conversation. How do I stop it?
Okay, it's just watching. Damn it. This thing's killing my back. Even my joints are starting to hurt. Okay, I get Everybody's it now. staring at us is what's killing me. I just I can only I move while he's not watching. The bet we'd crush it as partners on field day. Yeah, and if I had to do this for a field day, I'd drop out of school from the shame of it all. Okay. Hey, talk. You got any of those numbing patches? At the office, yeah. I have the feeling we'll need every last box. Yeah. Got it. Phew, we actually made it somehow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we all made a good team there. If the private eye gigs ever dry up, at least we know we can hack it as living billboards. Yeah, I think I'll try pivoting in a different direction. Looks like you got what I needed. Yep. Should be smooth sailing from here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, excuse me. Ah, uh, that hurt. Jeez, you little shit. Out of sound. Right. Oh, look what we have here. I'll just take this off your hands. Compensation, you know. Projection solution. Use uh, L to decide how much emotion to pro project. The stronger your projection, the more spice you'll add to the conversation. Will you decide to play it cool or heat things up? The choice is yours. Give him a dead eye stare. Give him a lantern and smile. Give him a damn and a grimace. Let's go. Whoa, what the hell's that? Oh no, run for it! Uh huh? Hmm. Oh, right. I need to go home. <laughs> Phew. At least that's over with. Yeah, but now we have to figure out how to do things, how to do what to do with ourselves. And we've got to get this thing back where it belongs. What are we gonna do? Guess we can head back to the office. Maybe Tsukuma can do something about it. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Mm. We're not getting this thing in an elevator. Yeah. Yeah, I probably should have thought of that. <sighs> I can't really use my phone either. Stuck like this, well... Shit. Well, better get a, go eat my eat ice cream before it melts. Hey, give us a break here. <sighs> no, you give me a break. You're messing with me right now, right? Why are you even doing this? Sorry, we run into a bit of trouble on a case. Could you help us figure out how to get out of this damn thing? Hmm. Mm, yeah, maybe some soap would help. Let me go get some mm, real quick. Phew. Thank god that's finally off. I'll go put this back. The sooner I've uh, uh, never have to look at it again, the better. Yeah. Here you there. Thanks, Kaito. Hello? Hello, this is Yagami. Ah, it's me, Manuka. Thank you for watching over my son today. He just got home, safe and sound. He's going a mile a, a minute, telling us all about it. Huh, is that so? Glad to hear it. I'm also happy the report Torukon seemed to do a fine job in the cafe. Uh, just that much closer to all grown up. By the way, Agamisan, are you aware of the animated sign on Isazaki Road? Huh? Hmm. Toru mentioned there's a funny face sign on Isazaki Road. He won't stop talking about it. He's trying to drag us over to go see it now. I was just curious if you happened to see it w w while you were out. 
just so we know where we are supposed to find it. Uh, well, uh, I don't know anything about that. Sorry, I was just too focused on Torakunk, I guess. Huh? I see. Well, I'm sure we'll find it eventually. It's really over the moon about the thing. But anyway, thank you for today. I'd love to reach out to you again if something else comes up. Yep. Oh, thank you. Please, feel free to call us anytime. Bye now. So, Torokun wants to see the funny face sign again. Oh, come on. Memoir of an Eagle. Okay, new, new ability. So we need like 20k for it, right? If I'm correct. Yeah, 20k. So, we cannot do that yet. So, let's just go back to here. And start another mission. So we have only one more here. 5000 SP. My name's Takeshi Okizaki. I work for a certain game development company. The director of our current project ran off right before we could finish the master version. And we simply can't do it without him. We tried to find him, but his experience making an espionage games m made him surprisingly hard to find. I would like to hire you to catch our director, Yagami-san. Sorry to ask this, but would you be willing to meet me at a wet kitchen on an Isizaki road? I'll be working from there so we can rendezvous more easily. Except. So, someone needs me to hunt down a video game director. Pretty unusual job. Guess I should hear the client out. Okay. Well, guess we are going back to wet kitchen. Not like it's very far, like we've already been there. So let's go! Again on second floor, seems like, yeah. There he is. Oh crap, another crash. Better compile. Oh, now what? If yet to receive a reply about the graphics on level 3, please inform us of your decision. Why the hell are you asking me? I'm not the director. What makes you think I have an nice say in that, girl? Oh, and what's this? Are you right to account for user behavior? Why? <laughs> the game is basically shovelware already at this point, <laughs> This guy definitely sounds like a coder of some sort. I'm guessing he's Okizaki san the client. Excuse me. Excuse me, are you Okizaki-san? Eh? Ah! Are... are you from Babylon? Please don't tell me or track me down about the delay. No. Uh, no. I'm Taka Kiyagami, a detective. Came here about a potential job? Oh, phew! You're just the detective. At first I was worried you worked up for a publisher, though you might have come to here to yell at me about how far behind we are in development. So, uh, could you tell me about this job? Oh, yes. Please, take a seat. Let's see what he has to say. About the case request. Um... You work for a game company, right, Akizaki-san? Which one is that? Hi. Yes, I'm a developer for God Dear Games. Hmm? Developer? Yes, uh... Game companies are generally divided between publishers and developers. Publishers are the ones who ma handle the physical printing or digital releases of the games. They also do the marketing, even planning, uh, these sort of things. Developers are the ones who focus on the production, coding, writing, sound, testing, all the work inside the game. Sometimes we reach out to publishers with the project proposals, while other times the publishers come to us with specific work in mind. I see. Didn't know it was divided like that. Some companies actually have different branches that cover both, but God tier only develops, since we are s such a small outfit. We've just got over a hundred staffers. I'm the publishing manager, it's more or less a mid-level position. By the way, what does the director do with di video games? I guess they are in charge of something, right? Hi. Right, the role can vary depending on the place, but ours is in total charge of the project they are assigned. If I had to boil it all down, the director's biggest job is making sure the game they are creating is fun. <sighs> but instead, our director vanished before the game could be mastered and sent off to the publisher. Now everyone's in a bit of a panic. Yeesh, sounds rough. This is our director, Ryuchi Shinomone. So this is who I'm supposed to find. 
about Shironoma son? What's the guy like? Shinonoma is, well, foremost, he's a genius. Really. Hi. Yes. Without him, the project wouldn't have gone, uh, even happened in the first place. In fact, he's the one who originally pitched the idea to the developer. The fact that it was greenlit so quickly is rather exceptional. Um. Yeah, that doesn't sound common. Hi. Right, it's not. It's the first time it's happened with God Tier. Not only that, but they gave us a quite impressive budget for the initial project. Now that's uncommon. I see. So this is Shinoma's uh, real whiz, huh? So what's the problem? <sighs> well, he's a bit moody. Actually, emotionally unstable might be even more accurate. Ah, so that's why he took off. Hi. Yes, this isn't even close to the first time it happened either. I've had to go talk to him into coming back each time. But this time he got really serious about it. Apparently he made a spy game a long time ago and he used what he learned during his research to disappear. He bucked the office before he left to keep the tabs on us, and we think he even snuck out in disguise to keep us from noticing. Wow, that's pretty involved. But why go through all that effort to ghost the job? You know my son's basically running on a single digit HP at this point. But with, uh, what with all the scheduling and task management, let alone uh, his never ending meetings with the publisher, he works until midnight almost every day, and even spends the night at the office most of the time. <sighs> I honestly can't blame him for wanting to get away from that. Wow. About Shinoma's son's location. Well, do you have any idea where he might have run off to? Hi. Not specifically, but he does seem to be in the city still. A couple different people have told me that they've seen him around town. Hmm, I wonder why he's ditched work, but hasn't left the city outright yet. Well, there's a chance he's feeling conflicted about not delivering the game. After all, the concept was his in the first place. Honestly, he reminds me of the most of a runaway kid. They might storm out of the house, but they are still too attached to go very far. Hmm. Well, if he's really that attached, we might be able to convince him to come back. By the way, where was he seen last? Around Sakura River Street. That was about 10 to 15 minutes ago, too, so he might be there. I would have checked myself if not for all the work. No problem, I get it. I'll go check around there. Okizaki-san, thank god I found you. We've got a situation. Shinanobugawa-san, what is it? The Babylon producer, Kinoguwa. He stormed the office over the delayed master. Eh? What? Uh, I'm serious, it's you. real bad. He was screaming, where's Shinanoma? Over and over? He looked like he might pop a uh, gasket on a second. Oh no. I, uh, I'll see you later, Yagami-san. Please find Shinonoma-san as soon as you can. Game and open sure sounds rough. Okay, well, let's go. So, Sakura Street River, huh? Where is that? Which one is the bridge river, Sakura? Is it this? Yes. So let's get the taxi. Over here. Okay. If I remember right, Shinoma son was le le last reported to be seen around here. Well, let's see if he's still around. Target search. Okay, take glasses. Nope. 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 That's him. Suspicious. Never mind. Looks very similar though. Anyone else here? Glasses. Suspicious. The 
hair is different from the guy in the pictures, but that's easy to change with a wig. This is shouldn't factor that into the profile. What the? Firstly face. No, that's a full-grown beard, but that could just be a fake. Guess I shouldn't factor that into the profile. Okay. This guy, he matches Shironomason's profile besides the hair. This guy in yourself as one of the homeless Shironomason? Gotta say, not a bad strategy. Excuse me. Are you Shironomason? From God Tier Games? Uh. Mm -hmm. Huh? Who are you? Yagami. I'm Yagami, a detective. Okizaki san from your company, he asked me to find you. Yep, I'm Shinomel Rice. Apparently the project is failing apart without you. Would you head back to the office? Buy me some food first. What? Huh? You want food? And work on an empty stomach. Huh. Uh yeah, I guess so. Oh, but not today. Spot me tomorrow. That guy's hooking me up today. Hmm? Who is? That guy. What? Damn it! Huh? Wait, don't tell me that was Shinoma son? Who, so who are you? Hmm, I sure love the raisin. <sighs> oh, hell, a disguise? Well, use your skateboard! Damn it, he played me and now he's gone. Hmm. Well, this sucks. I wonder if I can figure out where he's going. I should check and observe if he left any evidence on the scene. Oh, wait, where? Hey. Hmm? Hmm, a laptop. Is that yours? Nope. It's that guy's the one who said he would feed me. Guess he must have forgot it. Oh, is it Shinomus? He was fiddling with it all the time too. Sometimes he'd start screaming at it. Real pissed. Stuff like, damn box! <sighs> so he fled his job and wanted to keep with the game? Hmm, sounds like he might still be at least a bit interested in his progress. This laptop reeks of his cigarettes. But when it comes to smells, I just know what to go. Okay. Doggy. I believe in you, buddy. Who's a good boy? All right, let's go. Oof, Ranpo, can you track Shinoma son with this? Arf, arf, arf. Nice. Let's see where Ranpo goes. You got something? Let's go. You're doing great. Let's go, Mr. Dog. This way, huh? Something? Come on, come on. Move faster. Doing great. Okay. Is that him? You got something? What's with this dog? Oh, fool me once, shame on you. Oh, crap, you found me. You're not getting away at this time, especially not with a guy like me. Oof. Yeah. Cheer on my son, please go back to work. Don't you have a responsibility as the director? No way, that exploitive workplace will be the death of me. No way. Really? That seems like a stretch. It's no stretch. Long periods of overtime can lead to death by overworking. I've already done 80 hours of it this month. 
if I work anymore, I'm gonna drop hmm? 80 hours. Seriously? And that doesn't even include the unpaid o overtime I've worked. Don't underestimate the, the gaming industry. Huh. Wow. I was fine fitting up with it at first, since the project was my idea, but then that monstrous producer started breathing down my neck. First they raised the bar for quality over and over, but even pushing the deadlines back. Next thing they do, they scream at me to get everything done on time. Even my staff has started staff snapping at me. What are you gonna do? Hurry up and decide! All day long. I have no idea how much I'm shielding them from the producer from, from hell. Excuse me. Yeah, this producer from hell. Who's that exactly? He works for a publisher, Babylon. He's the one who controls all our funding. And he's one terrifying guy. I I think he's in the Yakuza. I'm scared he's gonna rub me out or something. Uh, hold on. I don't know if the Yakuza would rub you out over a game. Whatever. I'm not going back. You can't make me. Well, this isn't going well. Now what do I do? Knock it out with the client. Forcing him to go back won't work. He'll just bail again later. Looks like all we have to do is talk Excuse it out. Excuse me. Sorry Shinrama-san. Can you hold for a second? Huh? Hello? Shinonama-san, please come back. Okizaki-san. What are you gonna do if we don't get the master finished? All our hard work, almost a year's worth, out of the window. Ah? Shut up. Working for that company is nightmare mode. How the hell do you expect me to make that deadline? I couldn't meet it if I cheated and mainlined energy drinks after we were done. My stomach's a wreck, man. I've been finding blood in my stool. And I've been sleeping under my desk for months. It's murder to on my back. I know, but still. You need to come back. Kinugawa-san came to the office. You never seen a producer that angry. Kinugawa-san's at the office? Sounds like that's the producer from Hal. Actually, no, he stormed out after saying something like, Wait till I get my hands on that. Well, the last word wasn't a nice one. Ah, finally gotcha, Shinoma. Uh-huh. Kinugawa-san? Huh? Huh? That's him? <coughs> You rat bastard! Trying to skip out on your uh, end of the deal, huh? Or do I call this bullshit development? I'm, I'm not! Then what the fuck are you doing out here? The fuck's your fi fan be supposed to do, huh? Eh! You wanna see what a game's over like in real life, huh? You'll see it when I'll sink you to the bottom of Tokyo Bay. Yeah! Shino, man. Either you come back to work, or you die right here on that spot there. Time to pick. Welcome to your last life, Bob. No continues after this. Eh. Jeez, no wonder he's the producer from hell. This would be considered abuse of power in the Yakuza family, let alone the game industry. I... You... What? I... Quit. What? I said I quit. Forget that explosive bullcrap. I'll never go back there. I've been out of life since the moment I started working with you. Oh. Oh, you have gotta be fucking kidding me! And you call yourself a visionary? Well, visualize this. You're our fucking corpse! You're telling me you wanna disappoint all those people who fucking love your games, huh? And, you know what? I'm sick of this stuck shtick of yours. You're scary enough, you should come with an age restriction. You. Why, you garbage ass cold monkey! You fucking talk to me that way! It's really game over now! Yeah! Ah! Oh crap! This isn't just abusive workplace. This is really bad. Hey! Hey! Cut it out! You can't hurt him. Aren't you aware of the Abuse of Authority Prevention Act? Huh? The fuck are you talking about? Out of my way, dipshit! Or I'll kill your ass too! Oh come on! Where's this yakuza talk coming from? Aren't you supposed to work for a legitimate business? The fuck you mean yakuza? I've been a civvy since I crawled out of the womb. Okay, gross. But calm down. Rah! I'll crush your fucking skull! What the... Nagami san, run! When he gets this mad, he can't think straight. He's really gonna kill you. Huh? What? Die! You wanna kill me? Are you serious? Are you serious? You wanna kill me? No, 
sorry, buddy. Seems it doesn't work out for you, will it, huh? Well, bro, you kinda, kinda lost, bitch. Whoa, you're strong as hell. Way more of a secret boss than a trash mob. No way. Okay, dude. You better cool it now. Do you think your company is going to be okay with your assaulting a contracted employee? Uh, yeah, my bad. The blood just ran to my head, it's all. I forgot they warned me if I pop off like that again, they would can on my ass. Think we could all forget about this? Mm. But, um, Yagami-san, what should we do about him? Still not going back. Excuse me. Okizaki-san, Kinugawa-san. I think maybe you three just need to talk it out. Talk it out? Nah, that ain't happening. I know what I gotta do. What? Huh? Shinome? Huh? Hey, what? I'm begging you. You gotta come back. Without you, this game's totally fucked. It needs you. We need you. You know, Gawasan. I know I've been in your head of a bunch, but I also know you really are a fucking genius. That's why I've bent over my backwards to get this project greenlit. The sheer amount of ass I kissed to get the XX to sign off on it. So Shinoma, don't you ever forget fans all across Japan? Nah, the whole ass world, they are dying waiting to, for your next game. I should know, I'm one of them. I can't wait to play this motherfucking game. Kinugawa-san. I understand, but I'm not go working unpaid overtime anymore, okay? Yeah, yeah, I can live with that. Phew, that really seemed like it was gonna go south. But it all worked out. Chino, man. Don't you worry about that genius little noggin of yours about unpaid OT. <laughs> but you're gonna master that game on time, you hear me? Uh, I'll, uh, I'll get it done. Yagami-san, thank you so much. I think we might actually be okay now. Yep. That's good. By the way, when's the release date? Oh, um, actually, it's in a few days. Huh? Huh? That's all? Are you really going to be okay? Well, it's a VR game developed by a pre-existing engine for a specific headset, advanced and VR playrooms and whatnot. Unlike the other releases, there's no need to produce physical media or upload the ROM to digital storefronts. Actually, you could keep the working on it right up to the release date, so as long as you push the day one patch in time, although that's not the ideal scenario. Oh, oh a VR game. Those can be pretty fun. Please, do give it a try when it's released. I'll let you know when it's live. <laughs> cool, looking forward to it. Akizaki-san, bad news! Shinogo-san. What is it this time? Shinoma-san's thrown the whole team into high gear. He said he's redoing the fourth boss entirely from scratch. Eh? Oh, what? We just finished that. If we have to respec and redo all the programming and then debug, we are not gonna make it. <laughs> I know, but Shinoma-san won't budge. He said, it's about the quality. Again? What did Kinogu have to say about that? So long as the master's done in time, you do what Shinoma tells you. I'll handle the exits at Babylon. Uh... I don't know which is worse anymore, stubborn Shinorme or inspired Shinorme. And now that he's got the producer from hell in his corner, nobody can stop him. Excuse me. Uh, are you really gonna be okay? Hmm. Yagami-san, it appears I'm about to enter the final phase of battle. Yep. Alright, well good luck with the release. Here I go! Work in the game industry seems rough, but I guess it sounds like it could be fun too. Nice. All right, next quest. Back to Yokohama 99. What's 
the next mission? Come on. Let's see what, how are the jobs looking right now. On site demo test. Yagami san, it's Okizaki from God Tier Games. Thanks to your help, we've actually reached the finish line in, uh, in our latest project a twin stick shooter called Isoloilis. We're about to wrap up the final testing phase. And uh, where we have users play the game and give us their opinions. It's supposed to be basic market research, but instead, Shinomasan and Kirugawa-san have been at each other's throats again over the final build. They've agreed to let you make the judgment call on this, and I'm really hoping you can help us out again. I'll be waiting for you in front of the industrial hall building. See you there, Agamisan. So they are offering a test demo. Makes sense that they would want user feedback before releasing it. Looks like Shinoma and Shinagawa san aren't going to now let up until the last second. Yes, we are going uh, north of here. No. Here. To the VR building. Is that correct? Yes, it is. Hello. Yagami. Yo, Yagami! You check out Dyson uh, Cube lately? Those upgrades I mentioned are fully implemented now. Oh yeah? You did say something about that. What exactly did you change? Huh. You'll see when I put on the headset. Just swing by the venue and try it. Gotcha. Okay, will do. Okay, that wasn't the quest. With this one. Okay, san Yagami-san, so glad you're here. Did you come try out the game? Yep. Yeah, if it will be helpful. Do you plan on making any changes based on the feedback? <sighs> well, technically the QA phase is over, but we've got a bit of an issue. Huh? Oh, what's wrong? <sighs> you see, only a few hours before release, Shinoma-san and Kinugawa-san started arguing again. Oh yeah? I saw that. Is it getting bad? Well, uh... You. Hey, if it, if it ain't Yagami-san, you come to help us with our little problem here? Uh, sure. I'm telling you, Kinogawa-san, I'm not budging on this. <sighs> Shino, man, you're stuck in the past, pal. Gamers nowadays aren't looking to get tortured all the time. What? I thought the games where you die all the time sell like crazy now. Mm, those are different demographics. Not sure you get the market we are after. In that case, Kinugawa-san, I'm not sure you get the game design. Uh, excuse me? Uh-oh, this is getting ugly. Hey, come on, you two. Yagami-san's here. Let's not forget about the test. Right, right. The test. Good. Okay, Yagami-san, let's be off. Right. This must be where they are going to let people play the game. Yagami-san. All we'd like you to do is play uh, for a bit of the finished product. Nothing spe special about it. We just want to see how uh, you fare going and cold. We've all spent too much time in this thing to ourselves. Got it. Yo. You play games all day, Yagami-san? Any good at them? Oh, I hit the Arkies every now and then when I'm in the mood for it. So you're a real deal gamer, then, huh? Well, I wouldn't say that. Good. Perfect. Uh, uh huh. Alright, Yagami-san, go ahead and start. The game will walk you through basic controls, so it'll be all set there. And don't worry about game overs or anything, just relax and have fun. Yep. Can do. Okay, there's multiple missions. So, destroy the enemy, uh, enemies two waves. Moving out. Yes. VR. Okay. Repair chip, shot chip, three way chip, rapid chip. Whatever that means. Energy wave, beam shot. This. Damn it! Oh. I gotta dodge these. Got it.
Huh? I didn't even see that shot. That's fine. Ooh, that was fun. <laughs> hey, it looks like you enjoyed it. Yep. Yeah, I definitely play that again. See, Kinogawa-san, even Yagami enjoyed it, and he said himself he's not a gamer. That means no spec changes, huh? I win. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Sorry, what? But, that's not what he promised. You said if Yagami-san gave it a green light, you would release the game. Mm. Sorry, my producer instincts are just telling me this game won't be a hit as is. It's still too hard, gotta simplify the controls more. No, 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 that's not true. The controls were one of the highest, uh, highest rated specs of the game among the testers. Yo. Nah, still ain't good enough. We gotta push the envelope. We gotta break barriers. We gotta make it so uh, even entry level players can still clear a stage. With just a button press, that's the kind of thing I wanna see. You, you want a clear stage button? How's that even game at that point? They're supposed to provide challenges so users can feel rewarded for their efforts. I would feel rewarded by a single button press. <sighs> Chirama san, I gotta say, it's sad seeing you talk like uh, just another fossil in this industry, instead of really putting your mind to the problem. Well, how dare you? I'm visionary. Excuse me. Um, just to interject, I did enjoy the game. If it's fine, it's fine uh, as is. Maybe we can all just move on. Mm. Nah, that ain't happening. If you were a gamer, you would know how important that shit is. Uh, I guess so. Wait, this is about that woman, isn't it? Huh? That hostess, the one he brought to test the game the other night. Yeah, that woman you've been so into lately. Everything was going so smooth as silk until you brought her here. Once she was all... I can't do anything and... Oh, it's too hard! You change your tone. Chino, man, you prick. She said the game was hard and it put her in bad mood, and I would just want her to win her favor back. You're gonna be all, hey, Hikari chan, I put all your effing suggestions into the Gone Dash game because I'm effing love ya. <laughs> what? And you call yourself a creative. If you wanna use a game to get laid, go make your own. <laughs> Shiranoma, you motherfucker. I'm gonna kill you, asshole. <laughs> God, I knew it. Okay, let's calm down. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Yagami. I'll kill your ass too. I don't give a shit. What is it with you and kill this, kill that? Now even starting to wonder if you're really Yakuza. Anjouri. The fuck you mean Yakuza? I've been CV since I crawled out of the womb. Crap, huh. uh, I guess he just needs to get his head straight, so straight, one or the other. Fine, let's take this outside. You're gonna get it now, Yagami. Okay. Didn't we already have a talk about what constitutes as abusive power? What is it gonna take, man? I'm really sorry. Guess the blood just went to my head. So, can we release the game? No more spec changes? Yeah, but you know, I just want this thing first. This wasn't about me wanting to jump Hikari chan's bows. The creator's gotta keep an ear to the ground to learn what the audience wants. That means we gotta keep open minds to what we put in our games, too. And if things ain't going your way, sometimes you gotta flip a table or two to make your point. I can tell you the number of times I've seen a table flip will lead to masterpiece in the end. Uh huh. I'm just saying, it wasn't for Hikari chan, honest. I understand. We'll just say it wasn't. <laughs> At least the game's finally done. Really, that's all thanks to you, Yagami san. And feel free to stop by and play whenever you like. The game will be right here waiting. Yep. Thanks. Will do. Nice. So what are these contacts I got? Uh, I got a new item. Uh, where are they? This. Blind duration, huh? Useless. Okay, let's do the crane upgrade. And we just need 40 more thousand. 
get the last skill. And then we are done with the skills. That's cool. Nice. Alright, let's go inside and continue the quest we have for the VR. Oh, Yakumi-san, are you here to play again? Yeah. Yeah, I heard there's been some upgrades. Remember how I was saying the game needed a roster of badasses? I do. Did you put some in there? Nice! Hell yeah, I did. And thanks to my creative genius, business has been booming like crazy. We've got a ton of players, and I can't stop talking about which new character is their favorite. Oh. Wow, now that you mention it, I do see a lot of players in there. Mm, I'm just gonna mention this ahead of time. Some of these characters might seem pretty familiar. Hmm? Familiar? How? Eh, <laughs> well, they are based of people, you know. Does that mean... Uh, care to explain? Hmm. So here's the thing. I hired some designers to flesh out the characters, but I had to skip the concept art base. The cost per unit was way too high. We don't really have time to budget design a bunch of dudes from scratch, you know? <laughs> but then I had an F if any. What if I just f used photos of people I know? People who look dope in a game. Okay, I assume you got our permission. You do know about publicity, right? Yeah, yes. Huh? huh? Nah, I, I didn't fuck with all that. Otherwise, they would come asking for royalties or some shit. <sighs> Not good, Tashi Raccoon. Look, if you just play the game, you'll see why I did what I did. Anyway, try and defeat every challenger on the roster. That is, if you have the guts. Nice. Okay, well, let's go. Defeat rivals in VR Suguroku. Welcome to Paradise VR. Here you can play the latest virtual reality entertainment with one and only Dice Cube. Please choose your course and rule set. Short course, standard. Great, I'm ready to play. Would you like to fight against your strong rival? Yes. Please select the rival you would like to fight. Kaito, Higashi, Sugiura, Tashiro, Rian, Tanago, Suzaki. Okay, let's fight against. Nice. Here we go. Let's do this. Dice and Kyoa. There we are. Yeah, I know how to play this game. Well, somebody's looking like a handsome specimen old man. That's enough flattery for today. Let's get started. So I can use skill. Let's go. Plus two. Get some help. Okay, and now we roll. Roll. Four. Plus two. So that's six. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Event. Here goes that. More stars. You got yourself some stars. Now can you use skills left and right? Not really. It's four stars. Okay, can I escape this? Battle sequence. Your rival got the event phase. Oh wait, what's gonna be? Your rival completed a mission. I know your enemies, but still, I gotta give it to them. They got iron plate. Okay, let's roll. Six. So one, two, and now we decide. Three, four, five, six. Or three, four, five, six. Uh. Is that a safe? Let's check what that is. I don't think it's a safe. It's something else. This is the drone challenge, right? Yeah, drone battle. You look you're ready for your drone battle! Let's fly! Two, one, go!
Come on. Got it. Bronze plate, huh? That's useless. Turn stiff. Why? Give me a good one. One, two, three, four, five. Just getting a free gift, apparently. I'm not using anything. Not my turn. Now it's his turn again. He's climbing. There it is. Is it? What's he gonna get? Is that all you got? Three thousand yen, huh? That's nothing. Okay, what do we get? So I can get plus one. So let's do that. Roll up. Seven. Okay, one. Which one? Two. Three, four, and now it is time. Five, six, seven, or five, six, seven. I'll go right. Let's unlock the safe. Here we go. Oh. Come on. Come on. Nice. There we go. Give me a good one. I got a one. Ha ha ha. That had me sweat. All right, let's roll. Gift. Yes. Ah, gift space. Good job. Wonder what we'll get. One thousand five hundred yen. That's so useless. Okay. Turn skip. Really? It's gonna win at this point. Well, maybe not. He only got a two. But still. Okay. Well, I can't play. Give me a good one. Four, huh? Look, it's taken stealing his stuff at least. Oh no, he's climbing. Okay, let's go. Roll em. That's terrible. Guess we're fighting. Battle sequence. Okay, I have seven. That's not enough. I need eight, right? What's your rolling? It's rolling a two. That's nice. I suppose. And he has more stars again. 
Well, I can't use the other swan. I kind of want to do the roll change here. That's going to be helpful and maybe I can win if I have a high roll. Come on. That's terrible. One. This two. Three. Four. Five. We're climbing. We Just keep climbing up. Let's go. stars only? Uh, I hope he doesn't skip my turn. That would be terrible. Oh no. Okay. He needs to get a 1 or 2 or something or he's gonna win. Oh god, he's winning. He's definitely winning. I didn't know they use abilities as well. It's just terrible. I lost! I know it already! Over already? Game over! Yeah, I'm dead. Hooray! Wow. Okay. Please come. Okay, I need to actually do it again. Okay, let's do it. Standard course. Yes. Uh, Virtua Kaido. I'll just skip his turn and that's gonna be what I'm gonna be doing. I didn't know he can skip Here as well. We go. So, let's do that. So, you skill, turn skip, yes. Come on. Two, three, four. Nice, let's fight. Skipped, right? So I actually do now something. Roll up. Five. Two. Three. Four. And then let's go right. I'll go right. That's a gift. Yes. Then two. Skip my turn. Surprising. Come on. 
One, two, three, four. Which one? Isn't it better to go left and grab extra stars? Come on, a roll. Yeah, definitely better. Okay, skipping my turn, it's fine. I'm gonna skip his turn next time. Wow, he got one. That's kind of sad, you know? I'm gonna skip you next turn! Challenge. Hell yeah. Is that all you got? Nice. Well, let's use skill. Skip. Let's yes. play the odds. Now let's roll. Now. Five. Oh, my bad. Crossroads. Five. Oh, I have two more. Okay, good. It didn't this actually count. They have enough to get eight. Yes. No, I don't. That's fine. So he doesn't have a turn. That's fine by me. So now I'm gonna roll again. Roll them. Two. That's terrible. Gonna steal my stars. Not looking good. Oh no, I lost seven stars. He's gonna skip my turn, right? No, I can't. Good. But I got a gift. Okay, I'm rolling again. Now. One. Two, three. Guess we're fighting him back and getting our stars back. One star scrub, huh? Let's kill the shotgun, dude. <laughs> Nice. Will we get back our stars? Or how does it work? No, no we won't. That's terrible. Well, Rival's gonna skip me, right? Oh, he doesn't have a skip! Ha <laughs> ha! But he will have next turn the skip. And then he's gonna win. That's terrible. Okay, yeah, he has definitely the stars now. I'm just hoping for smaller rolls from him. On. Only four? What do we get? On, roll. Sushi? That's 50k. Okay, and it's gonna skip my turn, right? Definitely. I'm just hoping it rolls like one or two. Four. Mm. As long as he doesn't. Uh, as long as he doesn't get five or six next turn, that will be fine. Or if he doesn't have another one. Yeah, just don't roll five or six and we should be fine. Come on. How lucky is this guy? Damn. I lost again. Huh. Shouldn't we like get really high rolls though?
Didn't we get the upgrade for Exalted Roller? What does it even do? Right, skills, abilities, no, it was special. This one, yeah. Oh, it's just a starting a game. Just starting stars, okay, the star. Oh, fine. Let's go again. Kaido! Gotta beat him. The upgrades are useless, literally. In the first game, you at least the upgrades were useful, but here they are complete garbage. A turn skip, yes. Let's hope for something better than four. Yeah, six, that's much better. Just keep giving me sixes. Four, five, we got some stars back. Perfect. Here we go. Nice. Plus three, better than nothing. Okay, roll something big. Come on. Two. Okay. That's fine. We can climb up. That will give us a sum uh, as well. Roll. That will give us some. Okay, let's go up. These ones speed you up, is that it? And these ones give you grip back. Okay, let's get this one, glowing one. Okay. Keep climbing up. We got high enough. Do we get something good? Five would be perfect. Eleven. Well, wow, that's amazing. Now we can stop him for almost two turns. Give me a good. And he didn't even stop me because he doesn't have this stop yet. He will have after this turn, there but that's fine. Yeah, but that switch. point will be fur away. So, use skill, turn skip, yes, and I just need two more, three, so gift or fight, let's go for fight, because in fight we can get more stars, and that means we can skip his turn again. Just defeat them within time limit, that's okay. Very easy. Oh, come on. Nice. Just give me two stars, that's all I'm asking for. Two stars. Four stars, good. So now his, his turn is skip, that's fine. So it's my turn again, and I'm gonna skip him for the second time. Let's play the odds. Roll them. One, two, three. Four, five. Yes. Okay. And the second roll. I'm hoping something good. Come on. Five. This one. 
One, two, three, four, and another gift. Here we go. Nice. Well, now he's gonna skip me, right? Yagam is turn skipped. Oh fuck you, mate. Okay, he's got a gift, that means he doesn't have more stars. Yet. I cannot play. His second turn. What's he gonna do? Let's roll something small. Six is not small! And he's got more stars as well. How many? Three, okay. Please give me high number. Is this a joke? What's my luck today? Okay, I'm hoping six stars from this guy. You can only use snake style, that's fine. Six, four. Mm. Okay. Skip my turn then. Oh, he doesn't have one. But he has a six. Okay, but he doesn't have another one yet, right? Would that be correct? Come on. What a joke. Here Let's goes. open the safe. Fine. Will I get two stars from this, please? Almost there. Got it. Two stars. That's all I want. Three stars. Cool. Hey, okay, please no st uh, skip for you. Please no skip for you. Give me a good one. Okay, doesn't have one. He got another six. At least I can skip his turn now. But still. There it is. Yeah, I'm gonna lose definitely like if I don't win now. So turn skip, yes. And now just one, two, three, four, five, six is all I need. This okay. If it's if the last turn is gonna be one, I'm gonna be very mad. Three, four. Another climbing challenge. Here we go. Okay. Two, one, go. Three meters could be worse. Just give me better number than one. Can I use my skill? I can, right? It's skipping his turn, and I just need to use an ability to not lose, and that should be enough. So if I do this, I'm, uh, I'm forced to win. Whatever I want. Come on. Um, 
Congratulations! It's the best. Nice. Congratulations on clearing. Here's your first time clear the reward. Hug bomb, huh? We will need play passes in order to play, enjoy Lice and Club. You can get them as prizes from the batting cages. Please come back later. I have all the prizes. So I can't believe you actually put Kaidos on in VR. You didn't notify him, did you? Yeah, I notified him on, uh, him on these nuts. Shh, I don't know that bastard nothing. This is what he gets for jumping me for my clothes. If anything, you still owe me, too. In hindsight, what we did was pretty terrible, wasn't it? This isn't over! Yeah, especially considering you're a licensed attorney. The hell's wrong with you, man? Look, I'm sorry, okay? Che. Even the Yakuza don't strip people down for the hell of it. You two are real scumbags. Okay, so we gotta actually defeat all of them here. Oh, so we can have multiple courses? Let's let's have a look. What do we actually need to go in town and go? Paradise VR. So, uh, so this is for the RCLOs. So this is for the high score. Okay. So let's 13, 50, 20, 40, 40, 20, so on, so on. Okay. Let me just make a comment of it so we can keep a track. 13, 50, 20, 40. 40, 27, 35, 40, 45, and that's it. Okay, so skills, clear all, uh, clear all courses, yeah, that's fine. Skills 50, skills 100, Koronyan in Dice Cube, defeat 3 Tigers. Okay, that's gonna work. Let's try these drones. So, purchase items? What's that? We just buy all of them then? Okay, let's buy this, whatever that is. Additional mission data. short period and this is based on the quantity you have so we should just buy all of them right and they will be upgraded forever and these are like single use so I'll just buy all of them and if we need to buy them that's fine I mean we have the money for it so not like it matters All the money in the world we have. I think I have left like 15 million in the chips. I can put away at any point. Play game. Update. Yeah, we are fully upgraded now. Only 25 is the upgrade. Eh. A durability increased by 3. Oh, to 3, not by 3. And 2 rounds of energy wave. So mission 1. We need to actually beat it. What's the challenge around? I don't even know we have this. The challenge one. Well, let's go with this. Destroy enemies two waves. We need 13,000. Let's go. One, go! Looking good! Now. Nice. Run back up. This. Okay, 
Okay. Is there gonna be a multiplier or something? This. Well, I got the. Mission complete. Yeah, I got the high score, so that's nice. Mission two. Here we need 50k. Moving out. So let's go. Should clear half of it. Now we're cooking. I keep multiplying every time. Where are they? Where's the last one? Here. Okay. Next one. Hard. How many waves there are even? Oh, I forgot. Okay, we got a high score again, we just need to win. Nice. <laughs> Nothing I can't hit. Okay. Next one. Mission 3. We need 20k Moving score. Out. It seems. Can't stop now. Yeah. Now we're cooking. Gotta intercept those guys. Come on, give me 20k. Oh, it's not enough. <laughs> Is it because I, I died? We gotta do it again. Let's give it a shot. Oh, this is a different one. I misclicked, I guess. But it's also 20k for this one. Not bad. Secret weapon. Good. Can't stop now. 
If I got the 20k, it was gonna win this. Can we have it? No. Oh, it's not 20, it's 40. Okay. My bad. This This is not easy! Not even fun. Okay, let's uh, repeat this one and let's, let's try to get shot. the 20k. If I can. Okay, I got the score. Secret weapon. It's good enough to die now. Mission complete. Nice. I can just f uh, pretty much win it by by going full power, and that should be fine. Moving out. Like, I can buy these uh, upgrades, I don't care, but I just gotta be good at it. Okay, got the 40k. I pretty much just don't die. This can stop now. Got it. <laughs> Nothing I can hit. Nice. That's mission for high score. Let's, oh yeah, I should have opened just the shop. You can open it from inside. Uh, so play game. And shop. Alright, so we can rebuy these. Nice. Uh, and now mission 5. Right. We need 40k again in this one. So, yeah. So here, mission 5, we need 40k. Let's go. Moving out.
See what this does. Brought back. Okay, 40k we have now. Gotta now. finish. Gotta finish. Nice. Mission complete. Mission complete. Next one, 27k. Mission six. Let's give it a shot. Three waves. the 27 now we get to win in 27 just gotta win this this got it <laughs> nothing I can't handle nice next one uh 35,000 on out. this here my combo cancel because of my skill gotta intercept those guys can't stop now now we're cooking now we're cooking okay power's running out see what this is got it 35k, we got that as well, nice. Now just don't die, got it. Mission complete. Nice. That was mission 7. Two missions to go, so let's rebuy these. We got him. Mission 8 and mission 9. I don't know what's this mission, but we can do that as well. Sure, why not? So mission eight and mission nine, both unlocked apparently. Let's give it a so shot. So here we need forty thousand. Secret weapon. It's fine as long as we die early. It doesn't really matter. Those guys. Secret weapon. 
Looking good. Time to power up. Damn it! Oh, come on. I don't know if I can reach the combo now. I'll try, but stop now. not sure. Let's try. Let's see what this does. Come on. Yeah, we got it, <laughs> just barely. I can nice. Okay, and mission 9, 45,000 we need. Let's give it a shot. This time. Get stopped now. Looking good. Now we're cooking. Gotta intercept those guys. Got to power up. Okay, next group of enemies, that's fine. I'll just do this. Forty thousand we have, we need forty five K. Run back. Well, we got the score, we just cannot die anymore. Secret weapon. Not bad. See what this does. This. Secret weapon. Got it. Mission nice. That's mission 9 nice. High score. By these, and let's try for a high score in the survival wave as well. I don't know how important that is, but let's try. Three minutes we have to wait for. Moving out. Secret weapon. Can't stop now. Two minutes left. Gotta intercept those guys. Power up. Now 
power cut. Secret bad. Secret weapon. Brought back up. Secret distance. Secret distance. Secret can stop now. Now we're cooking. Power up. Gotta intercept those guys. Secret weapon. Yeah. Gotta intercept those guys. See the distance, see the distance. Secret weapon. Looking good. Nice. 45 seconds left. Five seconds. Gotta intercept those guys. Can't stop now. Looking good. Now we're cooking. Time to power up. This is bad. Secret weapon. This is secret. Secret. Yeah. Looking good. Brought Seven back. seconds. Mission clear. Hit. No obtained item? Well, that was pointless. Well, we got that done. Right. So that's nice. Let's have a look. Uh, shop missions, Paradise VR. Oh so yeah, this is all done. And here we just have this. So we gotta def pretty much defeat all the courses. For the side quest, probably we need to defeat all the opponents. Yeah, defeat the rivals. I guess let's go then. So, I guess there's six rivals, so might as well play each one once. There's seven, okay, let's go with Higashi now. Here we go. Let's do this. All right. So start with let's charge plus five. You won't roll this turn, but next time you move, you'll multiply your roll by five. That's pretty good. So let's try try going for that. Come on. Okay, two star fighter. Let's fight him. Ooh, scary. Defeat them with Tonfa? Okay. Ow. Ow. Fucking hell. This is literally impossible. A minute seventeen. Nice. Yeah, I should be able to do this, but oh yeah, I can do the kill on one of them. Nice. And the other the guy is dead. Cool. Wow. 
that was actually not as easy as I was thinking. Well, we got it. Gold rank and five stars. Cool. Rival turns probably gonna skip me, right? We can, right. He only starts with four stars, five stars. Battle sequence. You're going head to head against your rival. Now's your time to shine. Oh, I'm gonna win. Your dice won't you get more of yourself in this battle. What? So we have six Yagamis, or what do you mean by that? Yeah. Six versus one. Well, start fighting or something, bitches. Okay, let's go red mode. Come on. Yeah, call them. I guess I should go for a crane style, honestly. Is that the best style against bosses? Yeah, got it. Nice. So what did I do? Because I won. Roll. Roll up. Five. One, two, three. I can choose. Is there a better map? Okay, there is. So I have two spaces to go? Yeah. So either a gift or a star. Okay, I wanna get the star. Let's go like this. Spend! Seven? Go. Seven stars? Three. Man. That's fine. He's gonna skip me? Oh, actually he can't, right? Because I defeated him. Oh, he he cannot... Pinion now appears. What? Okay, nabbed my items. Does that include my... It does include my fucking stars. Wow. Come on. Um... One, two, three, four, five. And then I would need to get the Nyan. Or I can go one, two, three, four, five. Which would make me lose stars, but who cares? Because I'll be so closer to the finish. Three, four, five. I already have zero stars, so might as well lose them all. Not looking good. What's he gonna do? He doesn't have anything, does he? Bring it! Okay, he's not even going for it as well. That's good. Nice. Let me roll. Now. Three. Which one? I'll go left. Two. Three. This is losing more stars. I don't care. I don't have any. No way. I didn't lose any. Not seven. Okay, roll something small, please. How is he rolling sixes? Wait, why is he going left? Oh. I got five stars. That's not enough for him to do anything, right? Okay, let's keep going. Oh my god. And I'm going the wrong way. Maybe we can fight him and stun him. That would be nice. Just need to roll a higher number than him. Two versus two. Okay. Gotta be careful, but yeah, sure. Yeah. 
Come on. Nice. Oh, main rival. So the other one was just a clone. Good. So he's stunned, right? So I can keep going next turn? Maybe it's better than not having any pen. What? Oh, I still have to do this? That's annoying. Ow. 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 I'm not gonna risk it, I'm just gonna kill him. Good. Okay, I got two extra things. Um, so I got some stars out of it, right? Yes, five stars. Now he cannot play. So I can roll again. Now. Three. So right I need to go, not left. Right. And now left. This way. And this way. Oh, I'm gonna lose my stars again. Not looking good. Now he's gonna move again. Please don't throw sixes or something. Oh god, if it moves eight, I'm gonna be so mad. Bring it. One plus three. Five. One, two, three. I cannot win this turn. Hmm. Come on. Climbing event. Here goes nothing. Okay, let's go. I don't have any energy though. Very good. Oh, I do. I do. Okay, never mind then. Three meters only? That's not enough. Okay, I got seven, so that's nice at least. I hope he just doesn't. One, two, three, four, five. One to five, he can uh, throw. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I don't care what you do with this. And now I just need to throw a five, so. You're not cheating, are you? So I need three or more, if I'm correct. So roll change plus two, yes. And three or more, please. Please, game. Like, there's a high chance. Please. How fucking unlucky. Oh, maybe duplicates my... Will I get double? Will I get double rolls? Now's my chance. I do. Do I? Oh, 
No, I don't. Of course I don't. Come on. Roll. Nice. Perfect. Can I roll again? No? Of course, because now he's gonna win because he's gonna throw a high number. Bring it! Oh god. Lucky. Bitch. Over already? How fucking lucky are these bots? Like, why am I so unlucky? Actually, I'll just do it off stream. So, yeah, thank you all for watching. Let me save up here and we can play later. Bye!